so hello there everyone. Today I'll be playing a little bit of Minecraft. Um, but if you've read the description to this video, you're pretty sure this is not actually about Minecraft. Today I was going to go on a little rant about JX23. Now, recently I've been returned to YouTube to watch a few videos. And I watched a bit of Blame Truth and um, Wings of Redemption and discovered JX23 has been caught up in a sex scandal. Like, JX23 is actually one of my favorite YouTubers. He was actually the reason I got into YouTube. So, I was a bit distressed, like, what happened and stuff. So I started to investigate a little bit and discovered some of the facts. The, the facts aren't very sturdy, but I guess they are facts, so they have to do. Firstly, he was using Skype. Everyone knows what Skype is. I use Skype quite often. It is very hard for people to get in trouble using Skype. Firstly, there is a block button. Secondly, you can just remove friend, you can ignore, you can say basically anything to a person and they can't abuse you or anything. Okay, so he's, he was using Skype. Now, the problem was that the person he was talking to was 16 years old. He himself is in his mid-twenties. Okay there's nothing wrong with this as well. Because in England, which is where JX resides, um, the concession age is actually uh, 16. It's the same in Australia and I'm pretty sure it's the same in um, America. So, again, no problems. I don't know why everyone's raging. Also, um, he, he was apparently talking to this 16 year old and was starting to flirt with her. So, as guys do, they get pretty into it, so he decided to send her a photo of a man's dick. But it wasn't his dick though, so it's like sending someone a funny lolcat picture which involves a drawn dick on it. Anyway, um, yeah, so it wasn't his dick, apparently it was a really big dick anyway. But, um, yeah, he got in trouble for that. Um, firstly, uh, this isn't firstly, it's like fifthly, but, um, you could block that um, picture easily. It's one of the easiest things to block. Because, uh... It's, um... It's Skype. Skype prevent, can allow you to prevent yourself from viewing a video. So I don't see what the problem is here. So, obviously the girl willingly opened the photo. To, um, have a look at it. Now, if someone willingly opens a photo to have a look at said porn or something, then it's fine. They've willingly done it, and she knew that it was a photo that maybe she wouldn't like. So, it's her fault in that case. I'm not saying that what JX was um, doing was completely wrong, well, completely right. It was quite wrong. But there's no need for everyone to go saying, Oh, JX, you're um, a pedophile and you should, like, consider yourself in very dangerous territory or something like that. Wait, I don't I don't want to put this here. Okay. Um, yeah, so, JX was maybe my favorite YouTuber. To be honest, he was my favorite. He made awesome Minecraft videos. He was really good at Call of Duty and whatnot. 
and I discovered that he's gone. This really saddened me, so I really wanted to make a video getting the facts out, and I want to ask him to come back because he did actually delete his YouTube channel, which really depresses me. Like, such a great guy because of one mistake. Essentially, it wasn't his mistake completely either. Someone obviously didn't like him. So, they distributed the um, information about what happened. So, yeah. <sighs> this really pisses me off. I'm so angry I'm punching stones. <sighs> anyway. <sighs> I don't know what should be done with this case because it's completely legal. It's not particularly nice, but I can assure you it's legal. If someone wants to counter what I say, then go ahead. Because you can't really counter the fact that it's completely illegal. Um, es essentially, he shouldn't be forced to, to delete his account because it's completely illegal. It was probably just a small mistake, like testosterone was pumping or something. And he probably wasn't thinking as clearly as he should be. See, that was the only problem. So, what I'm trying to get out is that, JX, if you're out there, please come back to YouTube, because really not many people on YouTube give a fuck that you got in trouble, okay? No, it's like, fine, no one really cares that much that they want you to stay out of making YouTube videos and depress so many people who loved watching them. So, please, for everyone who's, who loved watching your videos, please come back. We don't want you gone, okay? Also, after that great jump, um, I'd like to just ask you to comment the video about um, anything you think that should be done about JX's case, and please watch some of our other videos, because essentially we got into this video making because of JX, and I'd just like to say thanks to him for everything that he's done the great YouTuber that he was and the great guy that he was, okay? See you later.